Welcome. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you step-by-step -step process how you can easily use invoice symbol for creating invoices. So the first thing that you want to do, you will have a link down below in the description. Click here on the create an invoice now. Now, when you're going to create invoice now, you can do through here or you can go to top right even, try it free. And you can fill everything here. So what I can do, what I might, what is my recommendation? Click on a sign up first. So you get everything saved. So I will add Marcus Stanelius, email address like this and password. Then click sign up. And then you have no invoices. Add your first invoice today. And now invoice number one from business name. It's going to be, let's say, uh, you would fill everything here, but even when you can create invoice straight away, my recommendation go to clients and like let's create clients so we can automatically edit right here. So let's go to clients, add the first client. Let's say this will be Marcus client, <clears throat> email address client Marcus like this address like this. Okay, then I would click close. We have the client, then go to settings and add everything about the company. So I would go name Marcus company email. It's going to be this one. Address line. Uh, let's say this is going to be Sanwi address. And you would add everything, business number, everything, fill everything here, what you see. So uh, when you're going to create invoice, your company will automatically appear. All the important stuff from your company will be there, right? So type deducted or per item none. The taxation, the invoice number, the currency that you can change here, the estimate number and payment information here. So then when we have the settings, we can go to items. And my recommendation again is to create the items that you're going to sell description. This is going to be YouTube uh, video rate 50 and then go to close. Now, right here, we are going to create invoice. Now as the fun begins. I will go new invoice. Ah. So let's say I'm going to click on this one and I can edit it and I can add a business business and everything. So that's how we can do it. Delete invoice, confirm new invoice. And that's how we do it. And you need to like uh, create it if you want to. But let's say that when you fill everything, you need to upgrade the account. So I'm going to try it free again. So you see everything. So we will just choose the business name and email and address. Then the same thing with client name, Marcus Stanelius, business name, Sanwi, build to client, and you would add email email address address, then you would add also phone number here, business number, invoice number. So this is the invoice, the title of the name, then you would add a number right here. So uh, the more invoices, it will automatically start counting for you numbers. But of course, you can add like number two, three, four, that's completely up to you. Then you have date here that you can change terms on received two days from now, three days from now everything item description so we would have item youtube video rate 50 quantity 10 and voila here you got it terms you can have also like five days 10 days that's completely up to you and then on the right side you can preview the email 
you can record the payment for this invoice or you can generate the PDF or you can also email the invoice and you can change the colors of it like this, like this and then you can simply get the link and send it to someone. Now what you can do also is to create an estimate. Estimate is a step before the invoice but again I need to do it like this and create invoice now and we can go to estimates and go to the right new estimate and this is really similar comparing to invoice but it's a step before that so next to the pdf you're going to see make invoice and you can make invoice that's how it works it's pretty simple and pretty easy so you can click here make an invoice and you would make an invoice from the estimate and again you see the right here that we're going to see the name build to so i would add a business name right here a build to to who is going to be built email address email address address number date notes and everything and tax currency and discount and yeah so this is pretty much it how we can use the invoice sample then next to the pdf you can make it invoice and that's pretty much it now if you can have any questions about how we can use the invoice simple uh what can get you etc ask me down below in the comments this was an invoice simple tutorial how to use invoice simple Invoice Simple Beginner's Guide. And yeah, thank you very much guys for watching and have a great day and goodbye. See ya.